Hello people on the internet that like looking at car videos. Um, today is an exciting one for me because in this box is a new steering wheel for the Jam. Now, I really like this XJ40 steering wheel. The early XJ40s had this more classic looking steering wheel because it hasn't got an airbag in it. Uh, the only problem with it, it looks, I think it looks great, I love it, but it's absolutely massive and it feels a bit like I'm driving a bus. Um, it's very skinny as well. I don't like skinny um, wheels and it's, it's really big so you kind of feel quite detached from it. It's got decent power steering so you don't need massive steering wheel for parking or anything like that so as much as I like the look of it and the feel of it as well, this is all leather, has this really nice um, 3D Jag head which I love. Um, I, I'm going to swap it. So what am I swapping it for? This. Look at that. So this is a Motomec um, steering wheel. I think it's about 13 inches, so much better size. I wanted to go for this design um, because I, um, I don't want to lose the aesthetic, the, the classic Jaguar aesthetic. This is a 92 XJ40 um, and it's just, I just love it. I love the interior. Um, and I want to keep the aesthetic, I don't want it to look like, oh, it's got a different steering wheel on it. I want it to almost be like what you'd expect Jaguar might put on it. So I like deep dish steering wheels, but I've got quite a flat um, steering wheel here because that is what all the old classic Jags have. Um, but it's just nice and thick. It's, do you know what? It's really good quality as well. Motomec. You can see it there. Uh, uh, Motomec. Um, 70 quid, I think it was 71 quid. Um, stitching's all really nice. The leather feels lovely and soft, um, and it's dead solid. So I'll put, I'll put it on and give it a wiggle test because I've had a few steering wheels that bend. Uh, I can be, I can tell for now that this definitely isn't going to. It's so so nicely made. Um, anyway, let's get this thing off. Oh, also, I won this on eBay, um, and in keeping with wanting it to be like. Uh, you know, original looking Jag aesthetic, keeping them with it. This is a genuine 80s Momo hub adapter. So I'm hoping this blinds match. It's listed for an XJ40 and XJS, so it should. But as you can see uh, on there, hopefully, you might see it, you might not. Momo. Um, so, yeah, it should look pretty cool. Now, what do we need to do first? We need to ping this off. That was easy. Um, see, that's what I really love on that. Looks dead cool. But what I've actually got <coughs> from one of my old Jags, from an old XJ8 I had, is the one of the, one of the wheel sensors. Now, I had a little play with this and realised you can prise that out. And that's like transparent. Uh, sorry if you can't, if it's not focusing on that. That's like a patch transparent piece. Um, which I reckon I'll be able to do something with the, the horn button. I haven't looked at this yet, so we've got some bolts in here. I don't want to use this horn button. Because well one, the horn's here. Two, it's quite nice looking, but it's a nice looking thing, to be fair. But it is kind of it doesn't scream original Jaguar apart, does it? And um, so I'm thinking I'm gonna do something along these lines. Um, but anyway, that's for later. So before I fit the steering wheel to the boss, I'm gonna take this one off and see if the boss actually fits because it's possible that it doesn't. So also okay when we are fully on the steering lock to the right the steering wheel's straight so I'll have to use that as my guide.
One surprisingly worn nylon nut. Okay, now it'll come off really easily. It came off really easily. Okay. Ah, okay. Right, let's have a look. Does my part fit this? Yes, it does. This first. Let's put it that way. Yeah. Okay, try again. Reckon that's the one. Reckon that's as close as I'll get it. Steering wheel tight. Look back on. 24 mil. Straight. 